What's up guys, Skid Rampage here. So today we are going Funko Pop hunting. We're going to the mall. We're gonna hit up the little comic book shop. Uh, Bailey's gonna be with me. She probably won't be in the video, but she will be with me. Um, I don't know if we're gonna pick up anything on this particular hunt. There's nothing currently out that I want other than the, um, at Hot Topic, they still have the Weapon Hex and the um, John F. Walker Pop, uh, but I can grab that one on Amazon as well. And it's like one day shipping, so we'll see. Um, I do have one hot cash. I might use it online instead though, cause I mean, last time they didn't really have anything. The only new thing they have today that I know of is the Mickey Popsicle one. And that's about it for any new pops. Space Jam did come out, so I think those are pretty popular. Um, but yeah, guys, last time I went, I know Box Lunch didn't really have anything. Hot Topic was a little scarce. They had a couple new things like Weapon Hex, but um, GameStop was a little lackluster. But that's like a, that's why I like going to the comic book shop in these hunts, because I think it spices it up a little bit. So we'll go to that closer to the end. Um, but yeah, guys, we're just going to go Funko Pop and get out of the house, do something different. SDCC was a little crazy, so do something different for once. Um, and yeah, if you enjoy these Funko Pop hunts, make sure to just leave a like, and that tells me you want more. Um, but yeah, let's go Funko Pop hunting. All right, guys, over here in Hot Topic, they do have the new Suicide Squad pops. They have Peacemaker, Rick Flag, they got Harley Quinn, Rat Catcher, Weapon Hex over there, John F. Walker. Down here, guys, they do have Bloodsport, which looks really good in person. Over here, they got in the Hot Tamales. That's actually really cool. And up over here, guys, they have the brand new Mickey Mouse holding Popsicle. Over here, guys, they have one available, but they have the Tapatio Man, which is actually really neat. I don't think I showed this one, but here they have the Polka Dot Man. All right, guys, over here in this GameStop, they do have a couple Death Dealers there. They do have Elaine, Madame Hell, some Seinfeld. They have the new Wrecker from Star Wars. Um, let's see what the rest of this wave looks like. Yeah, I don't really know who any of those characters are, but still cool to see something new. I like that. It looks great with the paint job. I believe they have Amazon exclusives, but they're only kind of slightly different. Down here, guys, they have some of the Mighty Ducks, Fulton and Coach Bombay. Uh, they got Raichu, that looks like a restock, a restock of the couple Infinity Warps. They got Ghost Panther and Arachnite, which looks great. Um, Gummy Bears, Starship Troopers, Happy Days, Sam Porter. Oh, they got the uh, Space Jam White Mamba. That looks pretty cool. Um, trying to see if there's anything I personally need. Up there they got the Skeletor Glow in the Dark, GameStop exclusive. Bubba Free, Mandalorian with Child, Jerry's Apartment, George. Um, let's see what they got over here. Well, they got some Magic the Gathering cards, Battle Academy Pokemon, some plushies. Yeah, I'm not really seeing anything from me, guys. Just trying to show you guys a little bit around this one. Uh, they got some Shang-Chi figures for Legends, Super Villains Marvel's Arcade, Mach 1. Um, let's see, some Injustice figures. Let's see, Multiverse Wonder Woman, Batman with the guitar. Robin King, Superman with some chains. I have a couple fig pins over here that I haven't seen. They got Mr. Krabs with Plankton and some money. Sonic, Scooby-Doo, Michelangelo, Cheshire Cat, Squidward Tentacles, Goku. Ooh, I love that GT one, looks great. Um, they got Ahsoka, Scooby-Doo, Sandy Cheeks, and Kohaku. Oh, from Dr. Stone, that looks great. All right guys, so our manga choice here is Inuyasha here. So I personally don't like the anime, but a lot do, so I wanted to show it off. As well as we do have Tokyo Ghoul Re here. Stay tuned for the new pops of this wave. Over here in Box Lunch, guys, they have John Wick sodas. That's really awesome. There's two available. They are 15 a piece. I don't have any Box Lunch money, unfortunately, but um, it would be cool to get a chase, possibly. Over here in Pop Cole, guys, they did actually just have an All Might and a Deku, but somebody picked it up to buy. They also do have the Hamilton pops in, so they have Eliza Hamilton here, and that is the rest on the back there. Here they do have a few of the Stitch, the Lilo and Stitch pops. So they have Lilo with Scrum, Stitch with Ukulele, and regular seated Stitch, which looks great. John Waters. I actually haven't seen that one yet. That's cool. Oh, up here, guys, they actually do have Godspeed, Killer Frost, and Super Saiyan Gohan. Oh, and Lucy from Fairy Tale. Looks like they restocked her. That's actually pretty cool. Guys, they also did restock Bill Cipher. I believe this is the one with the chase. Um, there was probably a chase here, but it's probably long gone.
Over here in this GameStop, guys, they do have the new Creed at Bratton here, uh, where he's holding the beans, I believe, and the napkin, which is kind of cool. Oh, no, 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 those are what he's eating. I forget what it is, though. What he's eating in those napkins that smell awful. Cool find, though. Uh, we also have the Clicker GameStop exclusive, Spartan GameStop exclusive, a lot of GameStop exclusives here. Um, Super Chicken there, Red Rocker, Critical Role, Tokidoki, the Cactus Sandy. Um, I'm trying to find, like, new, new stuff. Aerosmith, Animal House. Oh, they got a couple of the other exclusives down there. Um, Assassin's Creed Valhalla. They got a Pikachu there, Silver Metallic. Oh, they got the Bakugo one. Or Bakugan, excuse me. Tigerera and Skyrus. Seinfeld back there. Yeah, they got a couple cool ones. Nothing too crazy here, but I figured I'd come in this GameStop and see if they have anything. Over here, guys, they have Green Lantern, Jon Stewart. They have Nightwing as the Joker. I've never seen that before. I guess that's from Injustice. No, I mean, it's multiverse. I see the tag that says Injustice. That's what confused me. Um, they got Gorilla God in his golden armor. The Flash. Omega. Um, Batman again. And uh, Batman Earth 11. Huh. Yeah. It's kind of cool. I really like that one. That's different. I haven't seen that before. Over here, guys, they have this really cool DC Multiverse 2 pack of Doomsday and Superman. He looks angry. Look at him. <laughs> That's actually really cool. I found some new Funko plushies, which is kind of cool. I guess this is a GameStop exclusive. What is this exactly? It doesn't say what it is. And they have a little Mochibi uh, Bulma here. Interesting. Cool. Uh, Aizawa there. Boo pen. Any other pens? Oh, Goku and... Oh, Goku. And the little Bakugan figure. That's cool. We are at Walmart, guys. Uh, I was checking out their pop section. So we have a Chunk here. We have a Data. Uh, Mikey Sloth. The Walmart exclusive, which is cool to find. It's a cool one. What is he holding there? Oh, it's ice cream. Rocky Road ice cream. That's cool. I didn't remember that from the movie. I haven't seen the movie in years. Uh, then we have Dumb and Dumber Walmart exclusives. All the way down here, guys, they did have the 10-inch Iron Hammer that I haven't seen in person yet. I thought this was cool. So I figured I'd check out the Walmart section while we're, you know, at Walmart. Up here, guys, they do have a 10-inch Sorcerer Mickey, the Walmart exclusive, and 10-inch Blue, uh, which are cool. I think they have doubles of those. And the little Nightmare Before Christmas Figpin set. So they have Sally, Jack Skellington, Zero, and Oogie Boogie. That's pretty cool. A few different out-of-box WWE wrestlers. So we have Brock Lesnar here, which looks great. He's only 13 bucks. Uh, Sheamus here is 30. I'm not sure how much he is. I think he's like 70 or 80 in box. It's like about half off, which is pretty good. They got a John Cena back there. He's my favorite wrestler. Brock Lesnar's cool as well. I love their, um, I think they had an Extreme Rules match. I think it was Extreme Rules. Someone let me know, but I'm pretty sure they had an Extreme Rules. Um, they got Mr. Bean here. Are they have any other wrestlers? Not really seeing. Still got the Felicity Smoke. They got Ronin. I think this is new, which actually looks cool. I haven't seen this out of box. Kind of has like a Joker face there. It's kind of cool. Um, what else do they got? Anything else? Got a black and white Joker. Still got Doctor Strange. Uh, that's a Star Trek character. They got Punisher in the back, which is cool. My brother would like that one as well. And a Superman soldier. A few different chases over here, guys. They have the Good Omens set of chases, which is kind of cool. Um, then they have the commons under those. That already Kong. Some more of the Bakugan, Bob's Burgers, Naruto Six Path Sage, Luca. Um, they have some Castlevania. Oh, look, Star Lord from Guardians of the Galaxy, King Ding Dong, Aaron Rodgers, Stephen King. A bunch of chases. That's like, what, three or four chases? Wow. Alright guys, so now I'm back home. I actually only picked up one thing and it was from that comic book store and we decided to pick up Nathan Drake. I actually picked this one up for my younger brother. He's a big fan of the Uncharted series. I like the Uncharted series as well. Um, I've only played one of the games though. I've uh, watched the rest of them by uh, the Rad Brad play them for anybody who does know him. So I paid about seven, like 36 for this. It's like seven bucks, basically. So we do have it, Nathan Drake here, and he does have his grappling hook in a hand, which is really cool. And he even has the little um, naughty dog, like little symbol on his shirt, which I thought was actually pretty cool. But this was one of their better series, I will say. And I really like this pop. I wish I could keep it for myself. Does he stand okay? He does, this is good. My brother has a little shelf of pops, which I will be doing a family collection video pretty soon whenever that happens, but it is coming. Um, solid pop though, maybe if he wants the other ones in the set, I'll pick them up uh, for him. 
the other ones are like, they're all like 10 to 20 bucks, not really expensive. But for the most part, guys, that was pretty much it. Comment down below, what did you see that I recorded on this hunt that you guys might have wanted, whether it was from the comic book shop, whether it was from Hot Topic, GameStop, Books A Million, anything like that. Uh, manga choices were pretty cool. cool. We saw Inuyasha and Tokyo Ghoul Re. Again, stay tuned for that new Tokyo Ghoul Re wave coming later this year. I'm pretty sure maybe sometime in the fall or early next year, um, like January, February. Um, then we also did find all those chases. We found the Good Omens chases, the um, Robin chase, and then there's one other chase I can't think of off the top of my head. Found some cool Guardians of the Galaxy pops, a lot of cool out-of-box WWE pops. Um, I decided to actually pick up John F. Walker with the shield on Amazon, and I think I'm also going to pick up Red Guardian. And the reason I say that is he was like my one of my favorite parts of the Black Widow movie. I didn't really care for the movie that much. Like it was it I don't think it was personally one of the best Marvel movies, MCU movies, but it was it wasn't overall bad. There were bad parts of it, um, but I did really enjoy Red Guardian's uh, humor in it. It was actually pretty funny. So I think I'm going to pick up a pop of him. Not in his classic outfit. I really like the movie outfit. Maybe I'll pick up the Year of Shield one. We'll see. Um, but for the most part, guys, I think those two, John F. Walker and that one, I'm going to be picking up. Weapon Hex, I'm still deciding on. I almost picked her up today with Hot Cash, but then I was like, uh, I'm really still going to think about this one because I think I'd prefer the, re the original X-23, and I have enough Wanda Pops as it is, so... I don't think I need another, I don't think I need them mixed together. Though it is a really cool pop, still debating, we'll see. But for the most part, guys, this is pretty much my only pickup on this actual hunt. Um, and stay tuned, guys. I actually have some really cool stuff coming soon. Um, some really cool packages to open, that, some stuff I ordered, some stuff that was sent to me. Very, very fun stuff coming, and some giveaways. So stay tuned for that. Anyways, guys, if you did enjoy this, please leave a like down below. I'd really appreciate it. Uh, make sure to be checking out my Facebook group. It's Buy, Sell, Trade, and you can make a ton of friends. I want to say a huge shout-out to my Patreon supporters, everybody who has joined recently. Thank you guys so much. Seriously, I love having you guys. We do have a Patreon-only Discord if you guys want to join that. I have a low tier of 2 bucks um, That gets you right access to the Patreon. A lot of cool people over on Patreon to talk to as well if you guys are looking to make other collector friends. And we share a lot of our pickups and hauls and things like that, which is really fun. So make sure to check that out down below if that is something you're interested in. And lastly, be following my social medias, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok, guys, to stay up to date. All right, I love you guys. See you guys in the next one. See you guys later. Bye.